Ребят, всем привет! Сегодня я вам покажу Engine Room. Я попросил нашего второго инженера показать нам Engine Control Room. Ну что, готовы? Поехали! Hi, Piotr. Ready? Hi. Yes, I'm ready. Okay, show us where we are. So this is the ECR, the engine control room. So this is mainly where we control like electrical equipment, where the main breakers for most of the equipment, mm -hmm. let's say. Where the controls to switch from uh, shore power to generator, power supply. We've got the, the meters here. So at the moment we are at the shore power, it shows how much power we are drawing now, which is around mm -hmm. 100. Uh, 30 kilowatts yeah so in, in total we have three generators three generators and we can yeah they can supply up to 200 kilowatts each so 600 kilowatts in total yeah we've got also a, a management system so <coughs> that those for example are the, the fuel tanks uh, the other tanks like fresh water gray water black water and stuff yeah. Okay. This nice. Is like and this control room. Yeah, cameras. CCTV cameras. This is a chief engineer spot. A lot of uh, big bosses watching for everyone who is doing something. <laughs> yeah. Where is your office? My office. My other moment is here. <laughs> so I have a little computer to play with. Nice. Okay. And Kuba, third <coughs> engineer. This is his place. He's strong. His seat. He's yeah. actually getting. He got better seat than, than I did. And the same. Yeah. Okay. We got some fire extinguisher. I see behind of you. Some yeah. LED for yeah. safety. Okay. Show he, us. Uh, where do you want to go? Uh, I don't Inside. know. Show a workshop. Let's, Let's start with the workshop and the pump room. So this is our workshop. <coughs> uh, nice, tight and clean. Yeah. <laughs> Almost Wait. well. Almost. It's, it's getting there. We are planning for tomorrow. So tomorrow it will be all in perfect shape. Nice. It's like plenty of spanners, tools. tools everywhere. Yeah. A lot. A lot. Also here. Here we have more like consumables, like o rings, washers and stuff. Here a little bit more equipment. Nice. Yeah. So, some okay. tools. We want to pump the vacuum pumps for the for the sewage system. So they're creating the vacuum. So when you press the flush, it all goes because of them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Some more cabinets with the tools. Uh, a drill back there. Yeah. That's that's basically where we move. Where we do overhauls. All pumps. maintenance. All repair. Everything. If crew got a problem with the, any devices, yeah, first we bring it here. Yeah, this is the first place, like uh, ambulance. Yeah. Okay. So now we're gonna uh, we're gonna go to the pump room. Okay. Let's go. Starting right, from there, uh, those are the hydro pumps. <coughs> so this creates the uh, pumps the water in the basically the, the fresh mm -hmm. water system so whenever you open the, the, the water tap somewhere they're gonna start almost immediately you know? so, yeah. big 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 pumps here on the right we have this uh, shore power converters mm -hmm. so the power from the shore is going for them before this power is going to the, to the equipment on board and, uh, yeah boilers oh, okay boilers. device for the water pole that we have in the spa. Ah, okay. So this pumps the water and uh, you have this little bit of water going down the, the water pole. Yeah, this is the control for the boilers actually, for the heaters. Control heaters. Yeah. Uh, heat recovery pumps. This is a very interesting uh, system that recovers the heat from uh, <coughs> the heat of the generators. Mm -hmm. When the gen gen generators are running, uh, we can recover a little bit hot hotness, let's say, the heat from this from the coolant, and then we can heat up the, the hot water that we use mm -hmm. for showers and stuff. So 
Okay, cool. Let's go. Let's move on. Yeah, let's see the, the main engines. Here we are. Quite narrow the engine room, so for me it's perfect, but for the taller engineers it's not so great. So we have, <laughs> we have two caterpillars. Two caterpillars. They're 2,000 kilowatts each, mm -hmm. so 4,000 in total. We just had a, a big maintenance on the one of the, the turbochargers of, mm -hmm. of, of one of the engines. Quite powerful. Powerful. It's well, definitely good. to keep this uh, vessel moving, you know. Other equipment we have is quite important. This is water makers. So this water makers, yeah. This is producing the the, water, the fresh water from the seawater. It's basically using a a high pressure pump that pumps the seawater through uh, very fine filters. Mm -hmm. So that filters removes the salt basically from the from the water. And then we have very nice soft water that we can uh, literally drink after we put some uh, minerals to it. So it's well, with the mineral, especially for the deck team, it's very important. If you're gonna put too much minerals, yeah, then deck team definitely will notice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it will call us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah okay, well. some, some spare pumps. Spare pumps. I think it's here we. It's actually uh, one of the stabilizers. <coughs> We've got two pairs of stabilizers the aft and the port. This is on the aft? Yeah, this is on the aft. You can't really see much, but this, this is big, basically mm -hmm. this big pin that moves and stabilizes the vessel. So, so one is here, other one, other one is on the other side. Uh, Firefighting or bilge pump. This depends on uh, how you set the valves and stuff. Mm -hmm. This one is preset for fire, so uh, we can start this pump locally or from the fire locker and from the bridge. Mm -hmm. so. From the fire locker, yeah. Yeah. Okay. S so this is SOS. Oh, SOS. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you can see a little bit of shaft and uh, the gearbox. The mm -hmm. gearbox. Yeah. Clean and nice. Quite good clean, job, yeah. Kuba. I think, I think it, <laughs> <laughs> it came out pretty good. Yeah, and this one system is for um, dirty oil dirty and oil. Uh, oily beach water. Who is this? Mm. Side. We can just move on. So, yes, this is the like upper deck in the engine room. Mm -hmm. Here we go, this side. So, this is those are the controls for the main engines. For the main engines. So, from here, we can start and stop. Emergency stop as well. I think the emergency stops you also have on the bridge. Yeah. So, we can read off the the data from the engines when they when they work. So like exhaust gas temperatures of each cylinder we can read from here. Uh, pressures, temperatures, column temperatures. All parameters. All parameters basically. Yes. Uh, oil separator. Next up is fuel oil separator. So this this is polishing our fuel from the water and any solid con contamination. So this is basically running constantly when we are under underway. Mm -hmm. uh, hydraulic power pack. Actually, this is the, the aft one because we also have a, a forward one. A forward one. So this pumps the, the oil in at high pressure to open mm -hmm. open doors, or uh, that, that is also used for cranes and stuff. And uh, this is actually the. 
exhaust gas can go either under the water or above the water level. Okay, and now we're going to the generator, yeah? Yeah, that's the power plant. Generator room. Generator room, we got three generators. Yeah. Yeah, like I said before, we have three generators, and uh, in case of blackout, they will all start uh, accordingly because we, pre we can preset in which order they should start. Um, I think the middle one is the first to start, so if there is like no more supply from the shore, mm -hmm. the system will will switch them on uh, automatically and uh, it will take the load of the, <coughs> of the power necessary on board. And it's, it's quite loud in here when they when they when work, they so we, 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 yeah, we wear the protection all the time. Here we are, and we also got a genera emergency generator. Yes. We're not gonna go today, which is, just yeah, which is in completely different just area. <clears throat> okay, this is a place when we are keeping cell pipe, yes. cheap oil pollution emergency plan kit, cell pipe kit, and here we are. Here we got our emergency steering. Yes, here. the means of communication with the bridge, so the person that is here is putting them on and a radar angle and which will be the system to, to operate port si uh, starboard side and port side yeah. and the uh, pump system here yeah? local yes, exactly. one, oh, one one is local it's remote so you, mm -hmm. you, you, you control it from the bridge Short connection. Yeah, the box. Those, those three cables are the power from the shore. This one is coming from the shore right now. So it goes to that box to see where we connect it. Why are we okay. using uh, shore power when we in the port? Just because of uh, it's cheaper, or this is regulation? Well, this is I think more convenient for us because you don't have this noise. You don't you don't burn the fuel. So is it cheaper, general? Mm, I believe so. Yes. Yeah. Well, I know where we now. It's regulation. We cannot use uh, engine. Mm -hmm. It's uh, mandatory to use. Yeah, it's mandatory to use the shore connection just because of regulation, because of pollution prevention, and etc. and etc. Especially in the port. I mean, okay. Well, okay. I guess for today it's fine. It's enough. The main stuff you show. Thanks a lot, Piotr. No problem. I do appreciate it. And I'll see you next time. Too Maybe strong. you're gonna... Yeah, too strong. You see engineers. Like, it should be...